Hey everybody, thanks for joining us and we have another video question being answered that uh, came in to us through the teambowens.com blog page. Uh, the question was uh, from Matthew from Queens. How does Tony handle the hard edge shadows associated with small lights? You know, um, working with small lights is always a bit of a challenge in that regard and what happens is as a, as a size of source diminishes, three things basically change. The, edge of the shadow becomes sharper the smaller the light becomes the highlight becomes smaller and the highlight will become brighter so those three elements are present anytime you change any size of a source if you need to soften your edge of your shadows and you need softer shadows there's two things you can do either use a bigger source of illumination which will give you soft edge shadows or bring the light that you have closer now, don't get caught up in the difference between light quality and light quantity. Some people say, yeah, but if you bring a light in too close, it blows out. That's not the same thing. Bringing it in closer will increase your edge of your, your shadow softness and increase the size of your highlight. You real, you'll have to reestablish what the true exposure is and what the light quantity is. But in terms of light quality, the only way to really handle the edge of those shadows, if they're really too sharp for you, you've got to increase the size of the source. Now, we've got a webinar coming up on this topic very soon. Uh, we've got a full one hour just dedicated to size of source and how it's relative to its distance to the subject. So I hope that this will help answer the question in the meantime, uh, but we're going to dig into this a lot, lot further. So keep a watch at uh, teambowens.com for all of our blog posts, and feel free to ask a question there. On the right side of that main page, you'll see Ask Bowens, and there'll be a place where you can just type in your question, and we'll get those questions. We'll always respond to all the questions, and some of them will respond with a video. In addition, be sure to always check us out here at YouTube, and just go to our Bowens TV page, and you'll be able to see all the videos that we're producing, uh, all of the recorded uh uh, webinars that we've done so you'll see all of our archives as well as the answers and all these video uh, these video questions that we're doing mm -hmm.